That's a long f***ing fall. Well, that was lucky. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you can see it, so just walk towards it. Creepy little creature. So freaking creepy. I don't know that I would trust him. So Gollum's a little bipolar. Sa Saruman? His names are killing me. Oh yeah, he looks trustworthy. Someone's gotta ride doubles there. Yeah. Sorry, sir. I am Groot. Why? I mean, stop stroking it. It's creepy. Smeagol. What the f***, Gandalf? Where'd you come from? Confused. Sam's a loyal friend. Yeah, good. Play it up. <laughs> Yeah, he looks like half dead, right? Or like full dead. He has exercised the demons. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he doesn't look dead at all anymore. Can't Gandalf just go and get the get the get the boy? Just zap himself over there, you know? He's kind of a stinker. Yeah, because he will be him, right? He's like, oh sh did that work? But they made stew. He broke up with her. Let's watch the two towers. The Lord of the Rings. Jesus. Ugh. What the freak are those? They're screwed. Hmm. Oricon wards. <laughs> He's kind of a badass. Have you ever seen anyone mount a horse that way? Get a momentum to swing around. Those things are ugly. Bring your pretty face to my <laughs> that one counts as mine. Many on top of it. <laughs> oh no. Maybe there's like a little ledge there. Get the wounded on horses. The wolves of Isengard will return. Come. He landed in water. It's not that far of a drop. Um, he's maybe still alive. He's probably still alive. Right? Right? He's probably still alive. It's like a fortress, which is great, except for now they're all just sitting targets, right? She's alive? Beyond reckoning, thousands to storm the keep. Tens of thousands. But my lord, there is no such force. Yeah, he's been giving birth to that force for the last however long. Thinking those are really big staffs. They're gonna have to be really far away. They're trying to reach over the wall. With their sticks? <laughs> what is it? It's Saruman's army. The war has started. Oh, 
least he's floating. May the grace of the fellow protect you. It's a crazy horse he set free. Oh, giving him kisses. What a good horse. Such a good horse that Viggo Mortensen actually adopted this horse after this film. Really? It's one of his horses, yeah. Aww. That and the other... Viggo Mortensen's in that horse movie as well. Uh, Hidalgo. Hidalgo. He mm -hmm. adopted the horse in Hidalgo, too. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He loves horses. And there will be no comfort for you. No comfort to ease the pain of his passing. He will come to death. But you, my daughter... You will linger on. She'll have the memories of the love that they shared to ease her sorrows. She's going. To be mortal, right? To, she's going with the people who are the mortals? Yeah, she's going to the west. Who, uh, her father doesn't think they'll survive sorrow. He doesn't want her to die, so it's something. The will of the ring grows strong. It works hard now to find its way back into the hands of men. Men. Who are these Robin Hood folk? Did that one guy look familiar to you? Yes, but I don't know why. You'll find out. Oh, great. Maybe. You'll find out. I don't know. I haven't seen this. My men tell me that you are orc spies. Spies? Now wait just a minute. Well, if you're not spies, then who are you? I mean, do they not know what orcs look like? <laughs> they look nothing like orcs. Frodo Baggins is my name, and this is Samwise Gamgee. Your bodyguard is Gardner. <laughs> two were my kin. A dwarf there was also, and an elf. And two men. Aragorn, son of Arathorn, and Boromir of Gondor. It's like his brother or something. It would grieve you then to learn that he is dead. If something has happened to Boromir, we would have you tell us. More than this, I know it in my heart. He was my brother. Oh, jeez. It is rumored the weapon of the enemy has been found. The One Ring. This happened just before the Fellowship, mm -hmm. huh? I trust this mission only to your brother, the one who will not fail me. Well, it was fate that his brother should find Frodo, mm -hmm. Frodo then. It shows you how, why Boromir was so torn in confronting Frodo that one time, right? Why he wanted the ring so bad. Mm -hmm. Gollum, or I mean Smeagol. He is our guide. Please, let me go down to him. Where are you leading them? <laughs> Answer me. Why do you cry, Smeagol? <laughs> Cruel man hurts us. Master Trickster. Gollum's back. Precious! Eek. No! He's got to destroy it. That's where we're going. Into Mordor. The ring will go to Gondor. Great. That again? Yeah, oh sh <laughs> Where is he? Get out of the way! I'm gonna kill him! You are the luckiest, the canniest, and the most reckless man I ever knew. Bless you, laddie. Where is the king? She loves him and he loves the other one. Mm. 
All Isengard is emptied. How many? Ten thousand strong at least. Ten thousand? It is an army bred for a single purpose. To destroy the world of men. They will be here by nightfall. You're screwed. Let them come. No army has ever breached the Deeping Wall or set foot inside the Hornburg. This is no rabble of mindless orcs. These are Urukai. I have fought many wars, Master Dwarf. I know how to defend my own keep. He's definitely gonna die. Saruman's hordes will pillage and burn. We've seen it before. Crops can be re -sown. He's being really pig-headed about all this. <clears throat> if this is to be our end, then I would have them make such an end as to be worthy of remembrance. Well, that's stupid. You must call for aid. If they're gonna be there by nightfall, what does it matter? The old alliances are dead. Gondor will answer. Gondor? Where was Gondor when our enemies closed in around us? Where was Gondor? We are alone. Gondor's men too, right? So they'll they'll just be next in the line of destruction. Mm -hmm. More tree people. They are Groot. Oh, we must decide if the ants will go to war. I'm to be sent with the women into the caves. That is an honorable charge. To mind the children, to find food and bedding when the men return. What renown is there in that? I mean, inside the cave needs people defending the people also. Nelet Herain. Dan Karmunik. What's happened to his eyes? Then I shall die as one of them. They're not blue anymore. I mean, not elfin blue anymore. You gotta pick your favorite end. What's your favorite kind of wood? Other than mine. Oh my god. We only just finished saying good Maybe morning. Walnut. Walnut? It's not Mithril, it's just chain mail. Is Mithril the... That's the one that Frodo's wearing. The elfin one. Yeah. yeah. We are trying to get this adjusted. <laughs> oh, sh**. <laughs> Little tight across the chest. <laughs> Gentle king. Open the gate. It's Gondor. No, nope, not Gondor. Cool bows. Remember him? He's the White Witch's brother. I think. Long ago we fought and died together. Tonight you will do the same. We are proud to fight alongside men once more. So Elrond decided Send him out. Do the elves leave and live for eternity in the West? And let the world fall to what it may? Or do they fight with the men? And here he is, sending his men, his elves, to the men. Oh boy. Oh boy. You could have picked a better spot. <laughs> he needs to be one of those alcoves. <laughs> oh, great. Super. <laughs> right? Just what everyone needs a little rain fight. What 
What's happening out there? Shall I describe it to you? Or would you like me to find you a box? <laughs> <laughs> At least it hit somebody. Got one! Slippery little thing. I mean, what are they waiting for, though? That. So it begins. Taking a nap? Yes. Or... You are not hawks. <laughs> <laughs> you come to a decision about him. Now don't be hasty, Master Mary. <laughs> our friends are out there. They need our help. They cannot fight this war on their own. It takes a long Time to say anything in old Entish, unless it is worth taking a long time. No, oh, Jesus. <laughs> is this it? Is this all you can conjure, Saruman? I mean, it seems to be pretty effective as of right now. Suicide bomber. Look at those bodies flying. <laughs> Gotta take him, he's kicking and screaming. <laughs> He's my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Just toss me. Uh, don't tell me elf.
Like, who was carrying the big fucking ladders? The orcs. Where? Fall back! Fall back! To the keep. Turn around, take us south. South? But that will lead you past Isengard. Yes, exactly. The closer we are to danger, the further we are from harm. It's the last thing he'll expect. Mm. Oh, that doesn't make sense to me. <laughs> Me either. You are very small. Perhaps you're right. <laughs> Many of these trees were my friends. Saruman. A wizard should know better. Calling in the backup troops. Mm -hmm. It's a war cry. Oh, there's a lot of them now. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Pip knew that. A lot of that forest was destroyed and took Treebeard to witness it. Mm hmm Knew it would convince him. It's the first smart thing he's done. <laughs> it's calling to him, Sam. His eye is almost on me. Hold on, Mr. Frodo. Be all right. Frodo's losing it. Sam's gonna have to take charge here. You want to know what happened to Boromir? You want to know why your brother died? He tried to take the ring from Frodo. After swearing an oath to protect him, he tried to kill him! The ring drove your brother mad! They're here. They've come. Nazgul! The horn of Helm Hammerhand shall sound in the deep. One last time. Yes! There's so many of them, though. Yeah, brace yourself. Oh, good, that guy got himself out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Putting out the wars, fires of war. I mean, get yourself together, Frodo. I think his fingernails are like that in real life. It's like a nail-biter, yeah. 
Trees are gonna eat them all. Yes. Final count: forty-two. Forty-two. Oh, that's not bad for a pointy-eared elvish <laughs> princely. <laughs> I myself am sitting pretty on forty-three. Forty-three. He was already dead. <laughs> he was twitching. He was twitching. Cause he's got my axe embedded in his nervous system. <laughs> Turkey. <laughs> Some south farting look weed. It's perfect. One bottle each. <laughs> <laughs> Could be a distant relative. Oh, I get it. Barum. <laughs> Is that its name? They say a dark terror dwells in the passes of Pugminus Morgul. Mr. Frodo didn't mean for them rangers to worry you. You know that, don't you? He was trying to save you, see? Save me? So there's no hard feelings? No, no, no hard feelings. Gollum! There's hard feelings. Gollum's back. Yeah. His retribution swift. Why does it seem like they just keep getting further from the fire mountain <laughs> and then closer? The battle for Middle Earth is about to begin. That wasn't just the battle for Middle Earth? That was just a battle from Rohan. You've left out one of the chief characters. Samwise the Brave. I want to hear more about Sam. You shouldn't make fun. I was being serious. So was I. Samwise the Brave. Hey, Gollum! Where are you, Smeagol? We could not do it. She could do it. Yes, she? precious. She could. And oh, the ring? Come on, hobbits! Long ways to go yet. Smeagol will show you the way. Follow me. Is her the ring? Precious. Yeah, it looks like a pretty, pretty awesome place. So that was the two towers. What'd you think? Definitely a lot slower than the first one. You felt it was. I don't know. They're both kind of slow. It was longer. Parts. I think that's why it felt slower. And they Could had to be. build up the narrative for Rohan to understand the war at Helm's Deep. Yeah. Helm's Deep right? Yeah. Um, and I think you forget, like, the Fellowship is well-paced because that first hour and a half with the Hobbits, right? Right. And it's, you're kind of just, you're kind of engulfed in their world and getting to know, you know, Frodo and Bilbo and what's mm -hmm. going on, right? Yeah, they and added then, a whole new world here, which yeah. is good, I mm -hmm. guess. It's just, uh, I wasn't expecting it. Some good new characters, so. Mm -hmm. Who did you like most in the of the new characters in this one? Oh, of the new ones? Ooh. The, the one that plays in the boys, what's his name? Oh, um, Carl Urban's character? Yeah, Carl Urban's character. The writer of Rohan, the nephew of the king. Yeah. 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 But of all of the characters, the one that is taking the lead in my book is Gimli, Gimli. for sure. Yeah. He's awesome. He is awesome. He's funny, too. Yeah. I love the, the relationship between him and Legolas. Yeah. It's the yeah. fun rivalry and the, their friendship. Yep. Because if you get into the world of you know, Middle Earth, 
elves and dwarves do not get along. Right. Well. And the fact that these two have become best friends. Is really yeah, cool. it's pretty awesome. So, uh, what about the Ents? Well, they're cool. Yeah. Yeah. Part of the extended edition of the two towers is more with Merry and Pippin and the Ents. You don't see very much of them in the actual theatrical cut. Oh, okay. And I think it adds a lot to their... To their storyline. Yeah. yeah. And they ha- they actually play a very big part in the destruction of Isengard. Yeah, right? like the only part of the destruction mm-hmm. of Isengard. <laughs> yeah. If it wasn't for... Th- like That's a huge yeah. blow to the powers of Mordor there. For sure. Breaking the one tower down. So. Yeah, no, they, they were cool characters. Mm-hmm. I mean, I think the... Thought of a, a talking yeah. moving tree. It's pretty cool. I like to, if you look closer, you can see all the different types of trees in each end. Right? Yeah. The birch, the oak, the, the walnut, right? Oh, what I was tree beard? I didn't see any of those. I don't it was know. like an elm tree. Was the tree beard an elm I tree? Know, I don't know trees. Don't know. <laughs> what kind of tree was tree beard? What kind of ant was he? Let us know. Oh, yeah. Not Tolkien a, fans. I'm not an arborist. <laughs> you're not an arborist? Yeah. <laughs> Nothing you're, about you're not trees. A, you're not an expert on wood? Just your wood. <laughs> 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 Gross. <laughs> Leave that out. All right. What was your favorite part of this this film? There's a lot going on in this because we got... Yeah. There's like three storylines, really. Throw me. Right? Toss me, right? That's my right. favorite part. Toss you. Toss yeah. me. <laughs> Don't tell the elf. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, that was a great part. Yeah. That was probably my favorite part of the whole thing. Mm-hmm. I, I love that little detail of that one ant putting himself out in the fire. Or the, yeah. In the, in the water. Yeah, that's pretty funny. I, uh, to be honest, I'm disliking all of the Frodo parts right now, yeah. but... The thing with Frodo is his parts aren't entertaining because it's just... You, it's so intense it's the whole like, time, man. It's, you can see the tor- he's being tortured by the ring. Yeah, it makes time. sense. So you're like, like, it's oh, just, God. do something good. The here. ring is slowing him down. The, yeah. It's not where they're going, it's the ring is drawing all this stuff to him to slow him down. But they're about to head into Mortar, finally. It only took... Two films. Well, kind of. Who is she? I don't know. It's either the ring or some unknown yeah. female. So we'll find out in the next movie. All right, what should people comment on? Who's your favorite character in this? Right? Yeah, favorite character out of the yeah. first two movies so Who far. Who won the battle of kills? Was it Legolas and Gim- or Gimli? Right? Yeah. Let us know who you thought was the better fighter in the mm-hmm. battle of Helm's Deep in the comments, right? Yeah, it does. It. Yeah. yeah. So like, comment, subscribe. Thumbs up. Come hang out for the third movie, Mm -hmm. which will be another two-parter. Yep. So you got two more movies coming at you. Return of the King next time. And check out our Patreon link down below if you want to watch it early. Because if you're watching the Two Towers on YouTube right now, you can watch the Return of the King on Patreon right now. So check it out. The link's down below. Full-length commentaries and more as well. Till next time, have a good one. Bye.